Hello and welcome to Dave's Skillet. Today, beef stroganoff. Oh yes, beef stroganoff, one of my faves. I'm going to use medium egg noodles. You can get these just about anywhere. You can even get them at the, at the dollar shop. I'm only making a meal for one, so anything that I'm doing, you can, you can double anything I'm doing or triple or whatever. This is a, a menu for one, pretty much. I don't need much onion, just one slice of onion for this will do. Yeah, I want it diced up fairly fine. This is 80-20 beef. You can use a better grade if you want. That's up to you. Doesn't really matter. I'm using a uh, fourth cup of flour. I think that's a fourth cup, isn't it? Yeah, one fourth cup. Those noodles will be done in about just a few minutes. And I'll drain the noodles and they will go in the pan with the beef and the onion. And then I will make a bit of a roux. And then I will add a bit of milk. That was hot. Ooh, forgot I had it in the hot water. Oh, this is too well. That was almost a food bar to my finger. <laughs> Whoa. fast forward this but there's not that much to be concerned about. Salt and pepper is the spice and that should do. This is my dinner <laughs> so I'm in a hurry. Which is what this is all about is making small meals in a hurry. Mostly. Although I do have some bigger meals that require a bit more effort and time, this isn't one of them. Don't add the onion right away. You want to get this meat browned up a bit first. Otherwise, your onions will just turn into bye-bye. that be burned beyond recognition in scenery. Spice, we can add that straight away. I'm not going to drain the grease off of it. I'm going to leave that in it for a bit of flavor. It's going to soak into the flour. Which is why I'm not worried about it. I'll turn the rear burner off. That water is plenty hot to finish that job. Okay, it's time for the onion. I 
know what you're thinking. Where's the mushrooms? They're in the freezer. Somebody want to get them for me? Just kidding. Dobbs of them, but I'll put a few in there. That'll do. And I freeze them so they don't go all for me. Because I don't always use mushrooms in all my dishes, so yeah, they tend to not fare so well if I just leave them in the fridge. that flour into it until it all gets absorbed into the mix. Right. I want to add cream cheese to this. Uh, seriously considering it. You can do that. Let's get this off the fire. Hmm. I gotta drain the noodles. down to low. Shouldn't be more than half a cup of milk. I'm going to pour it in in increments. chemicals and things that can harm you. This is the best way to make anything is by scratch. Old school. No need to expose yourself to dangerous ingredients that the manufacturers use. went out and bought another bag of flour from the dollar shop. Five pound bag for a buck. I don't think I can beat that. And I didn't need any more milk. So that was that. Turn off the fire. And this is ready for me to eat. Just going to put it in a soup bowl, really. Smells delicious. 
got the mushrooms really, really going at it. Oh yeah, that is perfection. If you need salt, you can add it at this time, as you like. Very nice. Right there, beef stroganoff. You saw it in minutes. 